Hello and welcome to Unix Services Training. Please do subscribe to us on youtube.com slash Mukunda G Rao. Today we'll be learning about the Veritas Volume Manager where we'll see how do we go ahead and uh, utilize our operating system disks. So the first important point here is so we'll be seeing how to scan the disks and bring the disks into the Veritas Volume Manager control and perform various disk operations which are required for us. So let us understand how exactly the operating system presents the physical disks which are there. So you can see the operating system on the topmost layer and on top of that you will have the Veritas Volume Manager which are there which is there installed and then you will have the physical disks the physical disks either can be shared from a storage device or it can be available as a disk which, which is attached to your virtual machine or your physical machine so right now if we see here so if I use fdisk l I'm presented with different disks which is available I'm running my operating system on dev VDA which is a virtual disk same time I have dev SDA as another partition or uh, the disk which is available for us and I have dev SDB which is another partition which has been utilized. So presently what we have to do is we need to go ahead and see there are two different naming convention which has been used the naming schema which has been used from Veritas so we have an um, operating system based naming convention or schemas and we have enclosure based naming schema let's see how exactly we go ahead and view this information so what we'll do is we'll use vx dd command and we'll say get naming schema so right now we are utilizing enclosure based naming schema we have operating system based naming schema and enclosure based naming schema so we can set this to whatever we want so how do we set it do the same command and then we'll say set naming schema is equal to operating system based names so now if we recheck so now you can see it is operating system native naming methodology what it it is utilizing or else if you want to change it back to the enclosure based name so we can use EBN to change it back to the enclosure based name so we have these two methods where we can go ahead and utilize for the disks <coughs> so right now we have different disks which has been inserted the physical disks which we were talking about the physical disks which are there here 
is being attached. I am utilizing the KVM virtual environment. And now how do we view the disk? We use fdisk dash L in Linux operating environment. We can also use parted dash L. to see what are the disks which are available for us. And right now we have to list the disks which are there available for us. So we use VX disk dash e list to list so we have sda and right now if you see there are two status of these disks one says online invalid and another one says online so what do you mean by this so right now we have not given the complete control of SDA disk for Veritas Volume Manager. We have only given SDB disk. We have just given the control of SDB disk to the Veritas Volume Manager. And if you want to scan the disks, we can use VX disk scan disks so it automatically scans <coughs> so how do we go ahead and add the disks which are just available for us so what we have to do is we need to run a command to add this disk for or provide this disk for the volume manager utilization. Let's say VX disk setup. So we want SDA. So now if we reread the disk list, you can see both the disks are online. In previous, we did not have SDA online. So once we added the SDA for the Veritas Volume Manager, automatically it became online. So presently we have two disks which are online and this is how you go ahead and add the disks which are available for you from the operating system. Thank you for viewing the disk operation video on Veritas and have a great day ahead.